comes to a stoppage. Tyler Haley saying these short fights are killing me. Not the, the biggest uh, number of fights in the history of Hard Rock MMA. We've got nine fights tonight, and they are, in fact, ending relatively quickly, Gary. So it be an are. early night, almost as if the, the MMA gods are watching out for us and our, our chance at watching some of these main events for UFC tonight. Where Maybe you, so. You, you going to go somewhere and watch the fights? I think, yeah, if we can find a spot. I would say we could have Juan back on later to chime in, maybe a little bit of his insight into what he thinks in the UFC fights. But last time I had him on, all he really did was insult me. So, not feeling that so much, Gary. Yeah, I've got a room with him tonight. So. Oh my God, sounds cool. Jacob Howard, the lone supporter of referee Rob Mooney's stoppage. Jacob Howard saying, good stoppage. Anytime there's something subjective, such as a, a stoppage for a, a, a cage fight, Gary, there will always be plenty of room for... Very subjective. Very subjective, plenty of room for debate. Thomas argues in the cage. We are waiting on Josh Rivera from E-Town Beatdown. Daniel Ski saying hard blow, but a little quick <laughs> on the stoppage. Ricky Jones says health is more important than entertaining fights. That's Amen. the main. That's the main event. Uh, the father of Ricky Jones Jr. Yep. Chiming in saying the health is what's important for these guys. I agree. I, you can't be mad if you're air on the side of health, right? Like you can't be mad at that. Difficult to really make a case yeah. against that. Our upcoming shows, December 9th at the Northern Kentucky Convention Center in Covington, Kentucky, February 3rd in Shepherdsville, March 3rd in Lexington, April 14th back here in Bowling Green. See Josh Johnson there. Really a pioneer on the scene of Kentucky mixed martial arts. Been around a long time, black belt. One of the, the longest uh, black belts. Longest running black belts. Is that the correct verbiage? Uh, I would say one, one of the, of the first Brazilian Jiu Jitsu black correct. belts in yes. the state of Kentucky. Yes. Got Obviously, him, Michael Donald. Michael Donald comes to mind. We'll see him in a little bit. Or we, he was here. You know this song? I do not. No, you? No. It's out of here. How far away are you from 145 pounds? I weigh about 175 right now. So that cut would be not. It would be what? It would be hard for you. It would be difficult, but you know, our man Lance, <laughs> he's gotten up to about 170. Is he taller than you? Oh yeah. I'm uh, just under 5'10". He's about six, I think six two. When is Q Parks fighting again? I don't know, Jacob. I'm not sure. Four fights left. This is Thomas Argue versus Josh Rivera. Rivera in the gray trunks, argue in the red ones. Agri, argue, well, I don't know. Clarification. Got clarification, it's Thomas Agru. There you go. In the red corner with the red trunks, keeps it easy for us. That's right. Thomas Agru. Comes out left hand off the mark, Obviously Rivera. Josh Rivera in the gray trunks. Mm -hmm. Fighting out of the blue corner. Thomas Agru with the big left hand mm -hmm. in the tie up against the cage. Agru with Rivera pressed against the cage. Matt Elam. Antonio, what's up, man? Thanks for joining the stream. I'm not often in awe of a lot of people, but our man Antonio is watching the stream. Amazing photographer. He actually, my only interaction ever was he videoed some fights in Louisville like three years ago, but does amazing work. Josh Rivera with 
on the bottom in the gray trunks. Against the cage, difficult to work an open guard like this when you're against the cage mm -hmm. and trying to get your- Not much room to move. Not a whole lot of room for offense. At the same time, <coughs> can be advantageous to avoid being, you know, the strikes raining Such down on work, you. Man. <laughs> Thomas Agrew, Agrew heavy on, on, top. on the top. Can you really say heavy on top when you weigh 145 pounds? <laughs> it's all relative, Gary. <laughs> Pressure. Pressure from the top. Pressure oh, we're going for some leg lock action. No. Rivera gets an escape. Rivera raining the punches down from the back. This is not a good position for Thomas Agrew. Needs to defend himself here. Doesn't have really anywhere to go. Rob Mooney with the, the stoppage. Will we get people saying that was an early stoppage, Gary? Mm -hmm. I, I don't know. <laughs> From Agru, a health perspective, Agru he's right. didn't have anywhere to go, right? No. I mean, he was stuck there. Um, maybe if that was in a different, on a different part of the cage, it would have been easier. But he, he had nowhere to go. His back was against the cage. Tough spot to be in. Big win for Josh Rivera at an E-Town beatdown. Mm-hmm. Brian Kerr joins us. What's up, Brian? All right, someone take the phone away from Danielle. Whoever Danielle, take her phone away. <coughs> Jason Wynell. Ja Jason is he he's on his game tonight. He's, he's you and I had a big ever. coffee each. He's He's doing well himself. All right, ladies and gentlemen, one minute, 53 seconds. Your winner, referee stoppage due to unanswered strikes, Josh Rivera. Josh Rivera gets the win. Got some feedback on the Free stream tonight, once again, brought to you by B2 Digital, trading at BTDG, Hard Rock MMA 94 here in Bowling Green, Kentucky, at the Sloan Convention Center. You're able to watch the fights from the comfort of your